Hi everyone, Drew Coleman here, principal broker of the Drew Coleman team at Hassan Company Realtors, here with a second monthly market update. So busy season is starting to wane, but there's still a ton happening in and around the Portland area and sales prices are still increasing. We'll tell you how in a few seconds exactly how that's going down. As always, we're gonna keep this brief. Here's what happened in July. So the Portland metro area's average sales price increased 2.3% from $505,544 to $517,257. When you compare that average to what it was last year in July, that's a 9.3% increase. This is the opposite of the national average, which went down almost 1% in the prior month, which is the most up-to-date national data that exists. So we saw a 12.6% decrease in new listings from June, as well as a 10.1% decrease in homes sold for the same period. Uh, when you compare those numbers to the year back, which was July of 2016, there are 2.6% fewer new listings. However, closed sales have increased by 3.7%. So locally, we have 2.5 months of inventory, a slight increase from the 2.4 months in May, but still much less than the national average of three months. But you, you see, we are still creeping up towards that national average as things are starting to slow. The most active region was Southeast with 332 new listings. However, Tiger Wilsonville leading the way again with closed sales at 214. That's it for this month. Check in with me next time. And until then, visit drewcoleman.com if you have any questions for our local team. Thanks for watching, I'm Drew Coleman. We'll